Well, I don't say this often, but I'm sorry. Sorry I got you into trouble. Sorry I lost my mind. You know what, Castle? It's okay. Your overactive imagination has actually brought a lot of people to justice. In fact, it's one of the things that I love about you. Wow. And wow. Happy birthday to me. If that's my present, I can't wait to unwrap it. Later. Right now, let's just forget about the murder. Go to dinner. Celebrate your life. Come back and celebrate some more. Sounds perfect. Okay, so the car's gonna be here in 15 minutes. Would you like a drink from the fridge? The fridge? What? He just got a soda from the cabinet. So? So why get it from the cabinet? Why not get it from the fridge? Why not get ice? Oh, no. She's in the refrigerator. Those plastic trays in the closet, those weren't plastic trays. Those were refrigerator shelves. Castle? I don't know who Gates was talking to on the phone, but that was not Emily. Emily is in that fridge. She's not in the apartment. She's not in the fridge. There is no body. Yes, there is. Castle, you just apologized to me. I rescind the apology. I take it back. She's in the fridge. You know what? Let's just go downstairs and wait for the driver there. I am not going anywhere until I see what's in that fridge. What? You're going to stay here and wait for him to open it? If that's what it takes. OK, fine. Where are you going? Castle, I made plans for you. I dressed up for you, and I'm not going to let you ruin this night. So what are you going to do? I am going to go over there and open that bloody fridge, and then you and I are going to dinner and never talking about this again. No, don't do it. It's too dangerous. Not as dangerous as me if you blow up my plans. What if he doesn't let you in? Look at me. He's going to let me in. Not if there's a body in there. There's not a body in there. 